I think what, what has really allowed me to be where I am is that, if, if I may be so spiritual here, I think that, that um, it is my recognition that what I am more so than anything else is a spiritual being. And so my quest is for my spiritual involvement, my spiritual development, and everything else seems to fall into place. Oprah Winfrey thought the color purple was her big break. Little did she know she was about to become a phenomenon. So I think I, I, uh, that, that my greatest gift is my ability to be myself on camera. Only E.T. was with Oprah from the start, and she could feel that the big screen adaptation of Alice Walker's book would be life-changing. You know, I usually work, work on, on a level where I'm just, just on a cloud nine. I'm, I'm soaring above 27 now, really. I, that's, that's how my life has changed. I mean, just total, total, total excitement all the time. Just don't make me wait too long, Harpo. I was born to act. I was born to act. And I always knew that I would be an actress. Always did. When I was growing up on the farm in Mississippi and was sitting on, in the pig pen talking to those pigs, because it was just my grandmother and myself, and I used to, know, I used to do little plays and little skits with them, and I knew. I knew that I would be. The role of Sophia was an incredible gift for the up-and-coming talk show host. The character symbolized the obstacles she herself had overcome. Oh, my life, I had to fight. To me, she represents the bridges that I've crossed over on to get to where I am now. I have been wait working and waiting 31 years to get to this moment. So having been born on the farm in Mississippi, uh, born from a broken home and all those other things, you know, that people like to talk about, all of that has made me what I am. Yeah, silly. Everything want to be loved. This isn't a movie about black people. If you change the color of the, of the skins of all of us on there, you'd have the same story. This is, this is a story about a woman's quest for her own self. It's about self-discovery. It's about uh, the human spirit. It's about endurance. It's about survival. Ultimately, about faith. It's about Celie discovering that the power to be whatever she wants to be in her life doesn't lie in other people. She understands, as the movie says, God gets pissed if you don't notice the color purple. That's what this movie is about. Less than a year after the movie's release, Oprah celebrated the national debut of The Oprah Winfrey Show. Things are going pretty good for me right now. I've been in television since I was 19 years old, so I've been warming up for a while. I think that uh, what's happening to me is, is exactly what's supposed to be happening to me. I'm delighted, I'm joyful, and I, every day is a celebration for me, but a, I'm not really surprised. Oprah went on to co-produce a successful adaptation of The Color Purple for Broadway. And decades after her breakout performance, Oprah still holds the experience dear. All love, it's where I discovered love. What it means to love your work, what it means to love friends, what it means to be, to, to be impassioned by work.